One month ago, a homeless teenager from Bessemer wasn't sure that he would graduate from high school. Tonight, he walked across the stage. CBS 42 News reporter Stefan Dingle is in Bessemer with the story of determination and triumph. Tonight, Gunn Christian Academy graduated several students with triumphant stories, from teenage mothers to homeless teens like Deontay Curry, who lost both of his parents two years ago and was living couch to couch. Tonight, he saw the fruits of his labor. I was homeless at one point and hungry most of the time. I struggled getting my head back in the game. I struggled with demons inside myself. I struggled with being prideful. Pride aside, Deontay Curry said humbled among fellow graduates who also have overcome adversity, listening to his own testimony as he received a special award for his perseverance. Hey, you know, the students helped me, people under me, underclassmen, they, you know, go ahead, Curry, you can do it, you know, made this far for nothing. So I just kept pushing. What a story. I mean, what a, what a story, never quitting. And that's the thing that he can exemplify is that he didn't quit. And I, I'm just so proud of that. But this journey to find a home and begin this path may not have been possible without a friend's mother. He just kept saying, Mom, Curry needs somewhere to live. Despite having several kids of her own to take care of, thankfully, Takika welcomed Deontay with open arms, but not before praying about it. The Lord will always lead you where you need to go. And he led me there. I'm, I'm just glad that I could help him. You know, I pray every night, you know. They say he don't come when you want him, but he's going to be there on time. So the last minute thing with the graduation, it really turned turn everything around. Deontay will be heading to Alabama a and in the fall to study engineering. In Bessemer's The Finding, CBS 42 News. Congratulations, Deontay. It's a fantastic story. Just makes you want to tear up. All yeah. right. There